One day, we found a witch! We found a witch! I'm not a witch! I'm not a witch! Okay, how do you know that she's a witch? Um... Because she looks like one! Uh, okay... Did you dress her like a witch? No! No, 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 no! Yes, yes, yes! <clears throat> this isn't even my nose, it's the first one! I see. And this isn't even my real hat, they can just put, dress me up like this! Is it true? No, 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 yes, yes, yes. Okay, so how do you know that she's a witch? Well, she looks like one! She turned me into a newt! A newt? I got better. Okay, burn the witch! I'm not a witch. I'm not a witch. Yes, you are. Okay, so how can we know that she's a witch? Um, if she burns. And what else do you burn besides witches? More witches! Yes, but what do you burn besides more witches? Um, um, wood. You burn wood. Yes, that's correct. So, wood, what does wood do? Uh, burns. So if she burns, she's a witch! Uh, yes, but what else does wood do? Um, it floats! It floats! It floats! It floats! Yes, it floats on water. But what else floats on water? Uh, um, a duck. Yes, a duck. So if she, if she weighs as much as a duck, then she floats. Then, if she's a duck, then, well, she's a witch. So, I shall weigh her to see if she weighs as much as a duck. And then if she does, then she's a witch. And we shall burn her. Okay. That sounds logical to both of us. And me. <clears throat> okay. She weighs as much as a, as a duck. Burn the witch! Burn the witch! How do you know so much about witches and stuff? Well, you have to know these things. Yes, and do you do? So, what shall we do now? Um, I'll wait. Will you know? Will you join me in my night to the round table? Yeah, sure. Why not? Okay, let us ride to Tomalot. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this funny little scheme, and um. I, uh, picked this up from Monty Python and the Holy Grail. This is not suitable for children under the age of, oh, 14 years old to watch the actual movie. But this is just a little funny skit that I, that I came up with because the movie is so hilarious. If you are younger than 14 years old, I do not advise watching the movie. But you can watch this video as many times as you want because it's hilarious. I thank you guys for watching and I shall see you in the next episode. Well, I'm not sure when the visitor engines are actually arriving. Maybe next week. But, yes. So I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this little skit. And uh, don't worry, no witches or diesel were your uh, or engines were harmed in the making of this movie. Or, um, yes. So... I shall see you guys all next time. Goodbye. Oh, and I'm sorry that I didn't play any music in this video, but you know what? Even if I had, I just have to say that all music belongs to from Spective Owners, and I shall play the outro music because I want to. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to call this episode, but I will see you guys next time in the next one. Goodbye, and the next episode is going to be about the trains and their stories, so don't worry. Goodbye. I'm sorry if none of you like the music, but you know what? I like it, so I like the outro music, don't you? And I like the beginning music that I usually play in normal videos, and also the stories of my trains, so 
I shall see you guys next time in the next episode of whatever I make. This was just a funny little short, and I'm going to need to come up with a name for it. So, I have to say goodbye for this time, uh, sadly, because I am running out of time a little bit. But, I shall well, see you guys next episode. Hopefully you watch. And if you don't, then you will not have any idea what is going on the next uh, in the next episode after that. But, yes, I hope you enjoyed this little, um, skit, and, um, I hope you thought it was funny, and, um, please don't take any of this actually, like, offensively or anything, it's just a funny little thing that you should be able to laugh at and enjoy. So, I, uh, say goodbye to you guys, and until the next episode, bye.